Okay, so today I'm going to be talking about the one giant horse versus the one giant onion situation. Um, basically, uh, the main subject of this video is just going to be me explaining how one giant horse is playing it super smart. Like, he's playing it so smart. So, I'll tell you how he's doing it. Um, one giant onion is a actually really big YouTuber. He has 300,000 subscribers right now. And One Giant Horse, when he started his channel, he had like zero subscribers. And then he started copying One Giant Onion. And One Giant Onion addressed him in his video. So basically, uh, he gained so many subscribers from that. And, you know, in one day he got 1k subscribers and now he's almost at 2k. Go check, it out, check out his channel. Um, basically, they, both of them really didn't spread that much hate to one another, but they're still, you know, uh, they're still a big thing on YouTube where it's like, are you on the side of one giant horse or one giant onion? And honestly, I can't really choose. I used to be a, a onion fan, but, um, I just feel like I don't. I can be both. Um, the next thing I want to address in the situation. Blue Fusion is this guy who supposedly knows One Giant Horse. And he's supporting him. One of his One Giant Horse's biggest supporters, actually. And uh, people are saying that One Giant, uh, One Giant Horse is Blue Fusion. But um, no, he's not. Go check out Blue Fusion's what, some one of, some of his older videos, and check out um, his voice. Check out his newer videos and check out the newest community post that One Giant Horse posted. It's basically um, showing Blue Fusion's face, and it's literally like explaining that One Giant Horse is not Blue Fusion. Um, another thing I want to say: by the end of this, if One Giant Horse is like he's gaining subscribers a lot so by the end of this year he'll have at least you know a couple thousand subscribers so um sorry for the bad mic but um what happened is um now that let's talk about one giant onion one giant onions you know he at this point he doesn't really care he hasn't really spread that much hate. Um, one giant horse made a video called Onion Stands Be Like. Um, I don't, I just feel like they're just annoying each other, but, um, I feel like it's gonna end well, and that's really what I think of it. So, another thing, if one giant horse reacts to this, um, if you're gonna say which, if you're gonna ask me which side I'm on one last time, I did say that in the video I was in the side of one giant, uh, I was actually on the side of both, but, um, now I'm gonna have to support one giant horse, just cause he's just, it just amazes me how many subscribers he's gaining doing this, and, you know, I'm just really curious, um, some people on Instagram have been telling me to change, change my YouTube channel name to One Giant Tech, but no, that's not gonna happen. I'm sorry. I just, you know, I just feel like people, everyone except for One Giant Onion, even One Giant Horse, gets who have One Giant in their name are getting a lot of hate now. You, they, they do like you know get a little popular, but they they get a lot of hate and i really don't want the hate to spread to my channel and affect my channel so that's why i'm not changing my name to one giant tech um i wouldn't even do it in the first place but um another thing i want to talk about the last thing um how did it start one giant horse admitted that this was just for fun um, I honestly think that's okay, as long as he apologized, which I think he did. So, if he did, then, 
I'm I'm totally okay with it. Um, one giant onion. He I don't think he has to apologize because he actually is the one who, you know, got copied. But um, yeah. So if you might be wondering how one giant horse copied one giant onion, well, one giant onion does this thing where he eats an onion for every time a shit up. Uh, Every day, he eats an onion every day until a new Shrek movie comes out. Uh, one Giant Horse does the same thing, but with an apple. Um, but I feel like One Giant Onion is making, uh, you know, his own content now. But you know what, I, uh, this is, like, I'm really sure that this is what happened with One Giant Horse and One Giant Onion. I think what happened is that One Giant Horse needed subscribers so he copied one giant onion said he's sorry and stuff he still has the subscribers and then he makes his own content again i feel like that's such a reasonable approach and um yeah that's what i think one giant horse did um yeah so that's the end of this video if you have any questions leave it in the comments and i'll see you in the next video